What it do, YouTube? Welcome to my channel, man. If you new here, if you old, man, like, comment, and subscribe, man. But I'm back with it, man. I've been a little rusty. I ain't been around for a while, guys. And uh, today is just a quick little video, man. Since the shoe that we have coming out, they're calling it the Remastered Jordan 3 Black Cement. And man, this shirt right here, man, do you know? If you know, you know. And the shoe today, guys, it's the shoe that I had. I bought like a couple years back. I want to say about three, four years back. And I ain't even get a chance to even wear this shoe yet, guys. And it is the Air Jordan 3. Let's get into it, man. Retro OG. Black Cement. And I done had this shoe for a while, guys. And they even wore it yet, but they got the remastered. So I'll probably end up selling this pair. Ain't no sense in me holding on to this, man. You know, it's for in dead stock condition. Let me get to it, man. It's taking forever for you guys. OG dead stock. Haven't even worn this shoe yet. You can see right here, got the, you know, that glitter effect. And the shoe's been sitting in the box. We got that old orange Nike hang tag on them. OG to its purest form. Do you know, you know. Another shoe out the box. Just another classic, guys. Your old boxes should come like this. Old jump, man. We don't know how they're going to do with the new. With the new um, remastered, as they call it. Yeah, this is going to be a short video, guys. Let you know, man. You know, some shoes people do have over the years. I used to wonder myself, like, how people had these shoes and ain't worn them all these years. But things happen in life, guys, where you don't even get a chance to wear your shoes. And I love to wear my shoes, but... I'll probably end up selling this pair. A dope shoe, man. But to me, the white cement threes from the free throw line. Not the free throw line ones, but just the white cement ones. The original pair, I got those also. They somewhere in here, guys. I got them joints. But I love them over these. I love these. I love these too, though. These are the second favorite threes for me. As you see, it's dead stock. Never wore these. I bought these off eBay for resale, guys. And ain't even wore these. I spent like over 300 for these shoes at the time. But this is a dope shirt I had, man, for so long. I haven't even, I think, I don't know if I wore this shirt or not. It looked brand new, guys. I done had it for a while. I had a lot of stuff in storage. That's why I'm finna get back in tune with you guys. You know what I'm saying? And upload more. You know, get back in tune. I just had a lot of stuff going on. Just had to get a lot of stuff situated, you know what I'm saying? As far as my shoes and my clothing. We finna bring that to the channel. And yeah, I do have the, um... Let me see, guys, without knocking these boxes down real quick. Try to bring out the, uh, this pair of white cement, as you see. OG dead stock in it, too. With the car flipped over. I don't got the car for the other one, but for the black pair, but as you see. OG hang tag. Now, I did wear these. These are my favorite, though. I love the whites over the blacks. Now, I do have the, re the reimagines. I do have those, but this is the original as you see over the years, how that tab ages. These is the last pair that retroed in 2012, 2013, 2012, as you can see. But these are my favorite pair, man. I love these so much, man. I pay actually resale for these too. But yeah, I do have to reimagine, but I love these over the black ones, man. You know, black ones dead stock, as you can see. You got your white pair, you got your black pair. Which one y'all rocking with, man? Y'all rocking with the white or the black, man? And I believe these last came out in, my fault, guys, 2017. So, yeah, we getting a fresh new pair of these. I'll probably end up selling them. You know, somebody going to want to buy That's a collector. I'm a collector myself, but I love the white ones over the... Uh, the black ones, you know what I'm saying? But I love my threes. I am a big three fan, been a big three fan. I just had the powder blues. I sold them, had them for a long time. Man, the mocha threes is some one of the best Jordan ones you can find. Other pair in the box. You know what I'm saying? But I love these. Still holding up. Got a little wear and tear, as you can see, guys. Sorry for the lightning. You know, I'm back. I'm a little rusty, but yeah, man, it's time to drop y'all some videos, man. Uh, fashion and the gear clothes. Yeah, I done went to my storage. I got a lot of stuff, man. I had to get back, get back safe. So I got definitely some shoes and some videos coming soon, man. I'm a little rusty, but today's video was just really on showing you guys the Jordan 3. Because I know they're going to be having the uh, remastered pair. 
you know, I just want to get you guys to just show the OG form. Go over it a little bit. Put this back how it was. But, yeah, you guys get it. True OG with that hang tag, Nike. Orange. The white one. The 88s. I love them, man. These pair I love. That's why I have to get the uh, reimagines. Yeah, guys. Today video, just a little short one, man. Going over the Jordan 3. And I just felt like this was a dope shirt, man. I got this when I was in the... Uh, Miami, man, at the, uh, if you ever been to Miami, they got a Nike store. It was like on the corner. I don't know if it's still there or not, or if they redid it, but they used to have all these type of shirts. I got more retro shirts that you don't really see no more from the Jordan brand. Everybody love this, man. This, this is what, this is what sells. I don't know, for some reason, guys, it's like, you can have any other shoe, but it's just like something about, since a kid, I've always just been addicted to that swoosh sign and that Nike air. And I rock all different types of shoes, as you guys can see. I got Yeezys, uh, you know what I'm saying, uh, regular Air Maxes. I'm a big Air Max fan, you know what I'm saying? I got other stuff, too, you know what I'm saying? But, hey guys, these right here, I'm going to get into a discussion. These I kept these shoes right here, guys. These are shoes that, back in the days, if you ever went to the flea market, man, they used to have these. These weren't real authentic, but I found these in the stores, too, guys. I had them for a while. But I keep them just for nostalgic reasons, as far as just the memories when you used to go to the flea market. If you ever been in Chicago on 147 to Al man, you would know that everybody used to sell these back then. It was heavy in the game if you had these. I'm gonna show you show you these guys one day, and you can see the old the old Jordan box right there. You know this MJ right here in the in the Jordan tools. And if you ever been to 100 Trails, we it's still 100 Trails around. If you ever been there, you know they used to give you these after you win prizes and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? But that's a whole nother video, another conversation. But today's video, guys, we're just doing it on a Air Jordan 3 since they're doing a reimagine. Just a short, quick little video, you know what I'm saying? Not the reimagine, the remaster, my fault. But yeah, this is the OG pair. You see it got that little glitter effect on them. I'm going to clean that off. Just a dope shoe, though, man. And you know, some threes, I ain't going to lie to you. I look at some threes like they just plain Jane. But for some reason, when it comes to these, it just, I don't know, because Mike Warm or... What it is, but it don't feel like that to me when you see the white ones and the black ones. Out of all the, the other pairs of Jordan 3s you see, they might just seem like a plain shoe. You'd be like, why is it worth me spending that money on a shoe that look like this? But when you get to looking at these and you look at this, and you know this sells, but just a dope shoe, man. It's just a dope shoe, man. And we spend a lot of money on things that you know sometimes we don't even wear, man. Pay resale for shoes that we don't even wear, and it's a prime example of it, but... Nothing but shoes. Shoes is an investment also, guys. It don't matter if you reselling, if you rocking them, you stocking them. It's your shoe. Do what you want to do with it. You know what I'm saying? And just sometimes what you going to do with it. You done had it for so long. What you go, what you, uh, you ain't going to get your money back at least. You know what I'm saying? There's somebody out there who want it. You know what I'm saying? And that's, that's the, that's the good part of the resale though. And not being a reseller though, because it's things that you have just like a garage sale. If you got an old TV or a old couch and it's, it's vintage and it's nostalgic, people want that stuff still to this day. So, man, don't worry about what people say when they come to you buying something that you bought and you paid for. You know what I'm saying? But that's another topic too as well. But today's video, guys, is just on the Jordan 3. This shirt right here was just so dope. I just thought I needed to add it in this video. Like I said, we got the OG box. Like I said, I pay resale for these, so, you know, uh, I'll be on both sides of the table, so. And I spent over, like, three days back with eBay when they didn't even had an uh, authentic authenticity program. But I wanted these for so long because I'm a big three friend that I had to pay these because I wasn't in the shoe game for a while. And uh, I missed the opportunity to get these for retail. And, uh, yeah, I ain't going to overtalk you guys too much long, though. But, yeah, that's today's video on this Jordan 3, man. And, uh, yeah. They coming out with the remasters. And uh I don't know, guys. I just wanna I'm gonna get that pair, you know what I'm saying? But I'll probably end up selling these. Just a dope shoe though, guys. You can't complain or beat it. But yeah, today, guys, that ends the video. I'm gonna try to get back in the lab, man, again and, and, and be continuous and show you guys stuff. You know, I like doing shoe reviews, but it's time for me to show you guys some shoes that y'all haven't seen. Just keep it short and simple, man. To the next one, man. I'll check y'all out. Peace.